Hey guys, I'm LB, and as you can see, the simple fact that you're standing we are checking out Underground Part 3 by Ben77. Play through there, whatever. Let's get you're into it. listening to me means you've made a glorious contribution to science. Why, hello. Oh, we can't put a portal there, huh? Interesting, interesting. Interesting, interesting. Oh, I, I had to come down here anyway, okay. I don't know why I'm saving. I mean, it's the start of the map. <laughs> but hey. We got... gel in places, I guess. Okay, that's actually not too useful. Uh... Where exactly is this meant to be taking me to? I can't jump over there, can I? Can I? Holy crap, I can! That did not look as close as it actually was. Well, okay then. Alright, we can't actually go through this portal because it's covered up... slightly. Oh, the... the misery, the horror... of a slightly covered up portal. I guess we're not strong enough to push it off or anything. And we can still shoot our portal there, so that's nice. Although... I'm not entirely convinced it's intended. Interesting. Alright, well, let's just get in here. Don't seem to see a reasonable way to skirt the fizzler. Yep, can't cheese it. Let's walk in. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in a gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are gonna travel into your bloodstream and pop experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. That's weird. That had a large aim assist, didn't it? Look at that. That is a pretty big aim assist. I know, they're called placement... helpers or... something... some such. I call them aim assists. <laughs> right. Oh, that was... it got double looped for a moment there. It looked like... or maybe I'm imagining it. Hey, that works. Hey, fancy that. Well, that's cool. Oh. In fact, why not just get gel everywhere? What harm could it do? Hey, look at that, there's even gel there now. Cause why not? Science isn't about why! It's about why not! Yes, that quote actually fits remarkably well. Doesn't it? What about this one? Ah, uh -huh. Can we get Joe closer there? Aha! Uh -huh. Excellent. Alright, so now all we need... ...is to go through here... ...and bounce up here. Wow, the streaks are all stretched out, for some reason. I've never understood what causes that. Is it because they came from the side? Except these ones didn't come from the side, they came from over there. Why are they stretched out? Strange. Okay then. Well, we're really close to the edge of the science sphere here. Yeah, look at that. Look how close we are to the edge. I didn't even notice. Is this a smaller than usual one? I think it is. Oh, yeah. It's just no draw out here. <laughs> Alright, so. There's that. I guess we wanted that, perhaps. And that's not enough. Because why would it be enough? Can't jump that- oh, that- somehow that did a thing. Interesting. Wait a sec. Did I not look up here? Did I even go up here? How did I not see this? Totally missed that, didn't I? Right, save and continue. The usual. The usual procedure. You always gotta save and continue when you're playing Mario 64. Whoa! 
And, uh, oh crap, I... What did I do? Oh, I hit- I hit a stupid keybind that I have. <laughs> I gotta get rid of that. For playing co-op maps in single player. And I don't need to do that anymore, I can always look it at it again. Let's see here. How can I... There we go, perfect. Now I will not hit that accidentally anymore. Okay, this time... There we go. Look at this! I don't think I've ever noticed this little detail before if it actually being screwed on like that. <laughs> what is that? Frame- Oh, did they put metal... I've never noticed these details before. Is that just new in this map, or have they always been this way? I've never seen that before. What did I just do? Does this button even have any signage? Oh, it does. Okay. It's got signage down to here. Oh, that was it for this segment, I guess. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control room. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills or I can talk about the control group all damn day. Hmm. Oh. Now that is not what I expected that to do. Let's just go for it. Interesting. Why is there like a little area here? Huh. Seems that we can go back if we were to turn off this fizzler. Maybe we can? Is that supposed to be signage, or is that now, just- you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're gonna need to go ahead and get that out of here pretty fast. What is with the soundscape? It's like, constantly changing depending on where I walk. And not in the way you expect sound to change as you walk around a room. How bizarre. Okay, so I see what this is for now. I get it. I get it. Oh, well, that's not quite what I expected. That'll do, I suppose. Will it? Maybe. Actually, what do I want from that? What is all this all about? What's all this, then? Will it hit the ceiling? It will hit the ceiling. Interesting. Huh. And then, I suppose... We do this and this. Why, yes we do. And that gets us a new portal surface. Who knows what it does. And it allows us to hit that, which allows us to... What exactly? Oh well, at least we can get up there now, so that's a thing. Aha! That gets us a cube. So now we can do this. Oh right. Okay, so I actually want the cube on that. That makes sense. Moving portals are not a thing unless specifically enabled, because the engine can't handle them. There we go. So that's what that back wall is for. Yeah, look at that. You just barely see it through the dirt and grime on that glass. Alright, so now that we've accomplished that... I think we do want to leave that in that orientation. Because I don't think the fizzler turns off. Actually. Or maybe it does. Maybe I'm missing some key detail here, but I was under the impression it didn't turn off. I mean, what have I missed? What is there to press that I haven't already pressed? Have I not impressed upon you that there is nothing more to press?
What's the deal with this fizzler? Why is that a fizzler there? Oh well, I can- I can jump through this. We. <laughs> oh, that was almost too far. Can't get up here without the cube, huh? Well then what am I missing? I'm clearly missing some important key detail here. Yeah, I could probably shoot through there if I were to even get up there anymore. What's this fizzler? I don't think this is too helpful, to be honest. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Ah, uh, maybe I just need to do this. Yes, I think I'm just overcomplicating things. Maybe it's actually rather simple and straightforward. Like this. Whee! Yes, that gets us over here. Excellent. So now... We can do that. And that's what this is- that's why it says all like this. It all makes sense now. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. It all makes sense now. Let's, uh... For a while, let's do this instead. Cause why not? Ooh. And... I don't know, let's, let's put some there. I don't expect it to make too much of a difference, honestly. In fact, it seems to be making no difference whatsoever. Okay, that's... Okay, so we really just needed a cube over there. Never mind. Let's take the cube, then. Ah, uh, excuse me. I'd like to come through here, please. Uh... What the? What? What was the cube stuck on there? Is there like invisible collision or something? What is? I don't understand what just happened. If somebody knows, please explain. I'm so confused. <laughs> also, what was that other portal area for? What is that for then? Who knows? Ah, <laughs> oh, that's great. It acknowledges that we solved the puzzle. That's great. We Right. Well, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!